I'm getting Paisley ready for her doctor's visit. You ready, Paisley? You ready to go, girl? Homegirl's wearing a newborn shirt. This shirt used to swallow her. But now that I'm looking at her and looking at the shirt, I don't think she can fit it. If you guys been um, following the whole pregnancy journey and also like me having her labor and delivery, you know that they were worried that Paisley was very small and that she wasn't growing much inside of me, which is why I got induced. But, um, girlfriend is thick, okay, honey? Look at these little chunky, chunky legs. <gasps> Look at these chunky, chunky, chunky legs. Hi. Hello. It's me. Mommy. She's like, girl, what are you doing? Okay, I need to hurry up and stop playing because, um, yeah, the appointment is in less than an hour. So, for all the parents out there, I'm going to show you guys how to dress a baby before taking them to a doctor's appointment because when you take them they are going to ask you to remove all of their clothes but the diaper and it is so irritating putting the kids on some pants shirt jacket socks you gotta take all of this off so what i do is i put on a onesie from paisley i find a one piece that has the foot cover also the hands are covered um and it's just one piece that way you only gotta take off two items total so i'm about to put this on her wrap her up in her blanket put her in her car seat and we're about to go later on in the video i will do a um update on paisley so you guys can know like how much she weight now like what's going on in her life she pissed off at me i think she's hungry though but i put this <laughs> little hat on her so there's a couple of things that I have to talk to the doctor about her belly button, which I'll show y'all, um, and her formula, because I don't think the formula is the right one for her. Girlfriend is over here gaining weight, getting tall, thick thighs, save lives, right? But so let me show y'all her belly button, what I was talking about. Do you see that? Like, humongous. Um, I noticed when she was like two weeks, it started getting big and I'm like what in the heck and so um yeah see this is huge when she does this when she grunts and moves a lot it gets bigger so that's why it looks fully loaded but um hi baby so yeah I'm gonna ask them about this I had googled it and it's like an umbilical hernia and what I read is that um, around two weeks, which is what happened to her when she turned two weeks. That's when I've noticed. And um, I'm saying like around two weeks, it happens to some babies. Um, sometimes it goes away on its own as they get older, like in a few months, six months. Um, some kids have gone up to the age of two and had it, and they will have to get it surgically removed, or I mean, not removed, but fixed. So I don't know how it's gonna work for her. Hopefully it goes down on its own. I have noticed that like in the middle of the night when she's calm, uh, when I change her, it's normal. Like, I mean, it it's all the way in. It's not sticking up whatsoever, but I don't know. So I'm gonna talk to them about that and I'm gonna talk about the infant meal because she was just throwing up right now too. And it's like, she can't hold the milk down. So we're going to talk about that, but I'm going to update you guys on how much she weighs and how tall she is after hair. She's, she's going to get shots, which is why, you know, we're really here um, for the update of shots. So that way she can get her ears pierced as well. Right, girlfriend? Say yes, mommy. Yes. They burp her and everything, so I don't understand. You see yourself? Paisley is very alert, y'all. She is very alert. Okay, mommy. Okay, I got you. I got you. She hasn't even got the shots yet, y'all. The doctor was just holding her. She just started fussing. Okay, okay. She's mad, mad. Okay, baby. Okay. We're back home now. Paisley is. She fell asleep. Um, in her swing, because I put her in the swing since we got here. 
um but she woke up and she was hollering like she woke up hollering so she had a little nose sweating in the all that's how hard she was going oh it's okay mommy i know some legs hurt some legs hurt the baby oh oh look at that baby mm. So the nurse, the nurse told me to um, rub her leg throughout the day because they're going to be sore. Um, they prescribed me some Tylenol for the baby um, to take every four hours, I believe it says on the prescription, uh, because she, there's a chance she will catch a fever from um, these shots. So Paisley is now two months old. She is 20 inches. Gone girl. Okay, 20 inches. When she was born, she was out the look. I want to say she was 17 or 18 inches. Paisley is the smallest baby I have ever had. Uh, my babies always came out 21 inches and like uh, 7 pounds and up. But she came out, I think, 17 or 18 inches and 6 pounds even. But now at 2 months, she's weighing 10 pounds, 8 ounces. Okay, honey. Um, 20 inches, like I said. Oh, she, gosh, let me hurry up before she starts hollering. Um, so the hernia, this is, this is, um, so her belly button is a hernia. He said it's pretty big, um, but it's nothing to worry about. It's painless. It's something that usually goes away. I mean, well, goes down on their own. Um, if not, they do recommend surgery. So he told me, um, you know, he can refer me to a doctor, but she is pretty young, so he's not sure if the doctor would even want to perform surgery on her. He might just want her to wait it out. So I'll just keep you guys updated on her belly button um, because, like I said, this didn't pop out until she was about two weeks old. So I, when I was reading on it, it was saying a lot of babies that are born um, low that that are born at a low birth rate. Um, you know it happens to a lot of them so she was born at a low birth rate the reason why i was being induced in the first place but i mean she was six pounds six pounds i've heard of babies being born at six pounds i really don't know the deal on that but um according to them she had a low birth rate so <laughs> whatever but she is growing she is doing good i was talking to him about the formula he told me to just keep track on it um she's gaining so that's a good thing but okay y'all so that's the update on paisley oh paisley is very alert like she's been alert since she came out the womb like she will look at you and follow you with her eyes okay but that's the update for her now you guys we'll see you guys in the next one make sure you subscribe and like this video say bye paisley oh whatever girl okay bye y'all here's paisley she be really like looking around. Look at some eyes. She got my eyes, right? <laughs> you see yourself, mommy? Look at your hair looking like Doug. Um, what's, what's her name? Doug Funny. We got the three strands of hair. Paisley. It's okay, you mommy's bald head baby. And she like really follows you too, especially when Sean come around. Oh, when he come around, he is like her favorite person to see. Cause she be like following like that head turns everywhere he goes. She be like, you're like girl, please. Meet me down at that art to bring them vows with you. Girl, I'm more than honored to walk down that aisle with you. Morning ready for any day you decide on. The kids in the ignition, let's get our ride on. Top down, your head blowing in the wind. Instead of right stick, throwing soft. Here we go again, pay no mind, it don't matter. Above and over all, siblings and your brother and sister becoming in laws. Knew I loved your mama the first day that I met her. Girl, I'm trying to be that king to your Coretta. 
Sitting reminiscing about the way that we started You stayed down when the whole world seemed cold hearted I was dead broke, bad job, license suspended Everything wasn't alright, but I pretended Socially awkward, no one really paid attention to me It's funny, you the only one that seen potential in me You my rib, no matter the way they grill it If they two in this position, it's guaranteed that they feel it Knew once you had my heart, death can't even do its part Knew that you was worth everything from the one